I'm so excited about this. You're gonna make us a burger. I'm gonna make you a burger. I'm so excited. Us, I'm no. so excited about this. And what kind of burger is it? So I'm gonna make a classic smash burger. Okay, and what do you love about a smash burger? There's no sauce on this burger. Okay. That's what I love about it. A Great. lot of smash burgers out there right now. I mean, the, the original American burger is the smash burger. Okay. This is the very first burger. It goes back to the, the dawn of the hamburger. It's the first American burger. There were no sauces back then. And everybody likes sauces, I know, but there's no sauce in this burger. There is what I have to call the Midwestern Trilogy, which is mustard, pickle, onion, and that's it. Love it. And that's why you're going to like it. I right? can't wait. I already know I'm going to like it. All right, so talk us through it. So, first of all, Smash Burger starts with a portioned ball of beef. Great. Not a preformed patty. Okay, perfect. Your preformed patty, it's, it's, it's already preformed. I like, yeah, yeah, it's perfect. Second thing you have to do is smash it, right? Great. This is already, this is very uh, <laughs> remedial so far. Exactly. <laughs> But there's, some, there's actually some, uh, some uh, method here. Watch this, ready? Yep. 20 seconds or so. I've okay. Got a cooked patch on there, right? Just a patch, great. Yeah, that's it, so that will make it so it won't stick to the bottom of your spatula. Ah. Oh. I want you to feel that. Okay, great. This is a one pound, you can do it, oh, there we go. Oh, no, sorry. <laughs> you oh, can do that. Oh, I'm feeling it, all right, great. <laughs> I'll, I'll do the rest. the burger, man. <laughs> that was a good feeling. <laughs> um, and you have a 15, uh, 15 stool counter uh, yes, in New York City. I do, yes. And is that just exactly what you think it should look like when people have a good burger? Exactly. Yeah. It's, it's, it's supposed to make you feel good when you sit down at the counter to eat. Yeah. It tastes good, it smells good, and also, also looks great, good as well. So, a little seasoning, a little secret seasoning on here. It's not about this. Um, can you tell me about the coffee milk uh, that is on the menu? Yes. So I've never heard of a coffee milk before. If you're from Rhode Island, Okay. No? Yeah, well, well, okay. <laughs> I mean, you know, it, it, you did, like, it is a very small state, so you yeah. decreased your odds. Sorry, thank you. Sorry. Anybody from California? <laughs> there you go. <laughs> the coffee milk is very simple. It's, though, if you're in Rhode Island, it's especially Rhode Island. Okay. It's, think of chocolate syrup. Yeah. But it's coffee syrup instead. Okay. And literally nothing more than milk. Yeah. In a glass. I teach my kids this all the time. Don't fill up to the top before you put the syrup in. All right. Coffee syrup, right? Yes. That's it, and it's a little more milk in there. Now we can actually, here we go. Okay. I want you to try it. It's very so basic. it's just milk with coffee syrup? Mm-hmm, that's it. <laughs> it's really good, dude. It's just, yeah, I know. It just <laughs> tastes like, yeah, it tastes like exactly what it right? is. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Have you always been obsessed with perfecting a hamburger? Uh, I, not always, but the last 20 years or so I have been. And you've you been know. going around and you've got a, a book of all the regional, the best regional burgers. Yes. Uh, it's, it's called Hamburger America. That's yep. the name of the restaurant. And it's basically, it's a guide to getting yourself around America to eat authentic, original, ha regional American hamburgers. And were you surprised at how many different regional hamburgers there were when you first started? Totally. I, I couldn't believe how many there were. I mean, it's a truly unbelievable. I was mean, there I, something I that blew you away? Was there a regional burger that blew you away just because you never would have thought of it on your own? Uh, yes, something called the Butter Burger from Wisconsin. Okay. <laughs> Who's from, yeah, we're, you, yeah. You, I know, if you're from Wisconsin, you know what that is, of course. And so what is a butter, I mean, it's I feel like everything you've like, said so far is just the ingredients. Exactly. <laughs> So now a butter burger. Yes. What would you put in that? You do the math. It's a burger with <laughs> yeah butter. Exactly right. And that seems very uh, very it. Wisconsin. <laughs> very Wisconsin, exactly. And you taught a college course about hamburgers. Yes. Well, I've, I've taught some continuing ed courses at NYU. Uh -huh. I've done some stuff at uh, Princeton. I also do uh, consultations around the world for for people who want to know more about the American hamburger. Do you feel like? Do you ever think of like what Jeez. the uh, let a parent who sent their kid to Princeton thinks when they're like, I'm taking a burger <laughs> class. Well. <laughs> That's okay. Yeah, that's fine. That's hey, not your problem. I, I, I take yeah. it very seriously. They should yeah, too, they should right? Yeah, they should. All right, so now, is this, this an important part to cover it up for the cheese to melt? Absolutely. You know why? Because what? I want the cheese to melt before the burger overcooks. Very oh, important. that's very, Don't very important. I'm going to dope the bun. Next thing. Okay. Ready? The trilogy. All right. Mustard, oh, yeah, mustard. That's very it. excited. When you said mustard. no sauce, I was worried that that meant no, like, mustard. No, 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 no. Okay, so, got it. Mustard. This is just diced onion. That's all it is, right? Okay. Diced onion. Not much of it. And two pickle chips. We use on there. Two dill pickle chips, right? Okay. This is ready. Ready? All right. I'm very excited. You're excited. I am. <laughs> so Me when too. people come to your restaurant, is this? I mean, it, how, what percentage of it are ordering this burger? So uh, we have two burgers in the menu. We have okay. a, the Oklahoma fried onion burger, and we have what this is burger. That, the Oklahoma fried onion yeah, burger. Yeah. So okay. Actually, it's a burger. It's the same ball of beef, but uh -huh. the onions are. Thin fried. sliced onions are fried, <laughs> smashed into the burger and fried into the beef. Yeah. Okay, great. You're, you're catching And so what is the, <laughs> and, but is, it, is it about 50-50 split or do most people want the smash? People, it's 50-50. Is it really? Yeah, people, it's amazing. People, do, they, they, want, they want actually one of each, I feel like right now. Yeah. So you see how thin that is. That's great. It's been smashed, as you know. Now, do you, I mean, do you still have a love for like the fat burger? Because like, so sometimes I will go, um, 
Uh, I'm not going to name names. My father-in-law. Yeah. He will. <laughs> he makes these like big fat patties, and I just like it seems like very like I don't know. I like how fast this yes. goes, and I like a flat burger. Do you also like a big fat burger? I do, but I, I prefer to. I tend to gravitate to this burger much more often. Okay. Much yeah. I, I, I'm, I'm I, the amount I want to grab this out of your hand. Yeah, it's really required. <laughs> I made it easy to handle. It's in paper. Oh, that's so. very excited about this. Oh, so good. Yeah. <laughs> it's very straightforward. I mean, there's not, it's not supposed to be anything but an uncomplicated burger. I think he ate some paper. Oh, no, he didn't. Good, okay. <laughs> Just like, you know, he looks hungry. <laughs> Don't make him think I ate the paper. He did, he did. That's right. That's right. <laughs> this is fantastic. Thank, Thank you. you much. Hey, you guys, you. Jordan Mung. Hamburger America, everybody. This is the best burger ever.